bed. This is what I... Meet me in the backyard, okay? Okay. Make yourselves at home. It's going to be a bumpy ride. This is Christina Applegate. Hi. She's nothing like her character. No. She's way dumber. Thank you. This is great. If you ever want to get somebody back, you get a little spit wad, put it down on them, they'll never know what happened. Come on, you guys want to come with me? Okay, cool. Making friends here at the subway. Hurry up, she's got to get to the booth. She's the director. <laughs> Dad. A full day's work. My window. Feeding time, it's roundup time at the birth house, and now uh, these guys are darn hungry. So, watch those bare legs. Disgusting. Okay. Uh huh. No air conditioning back there. All right, that's it. I'm gonna have a little workout. I'm exhausted. Wish I had time for a jacuzzi. Trash can all the way out in the middle of the... It's a glamorous life here in Studio City. But you know what? The biggest claim to fame. Oh, this is the thing I wanted to show you. Check it out. That's the Brady Bunch house, ladies and gentlemen. That is the claim to fame of my neighborhood. Before I moved in. Now, I am not just sort of faking this manic pace for your benefit. This is the whole, the way my whole day will go, I swear. Okay. Yep, folks, even big stars like me got to put money in the meter. 20 minutes per quarter. This is a ripoff. I'm driving in the parking lot. That's it. I'm too cheap. I'm not paying that. Going in the parking lot. What, I'm made of money or what? Okay, cool. Making friends here at the subway. The guys across the street, they never seen a big star like me before. Look at, they're all googly eyed. Thrilled to death. Okay, here we go. Well, I, you know, this is not the way I was brought up. To eat in front of people, but, you know, hey. I'll do a real Hollywood thing right now. I'm gonna call the office. I do need a car phone, the government. I do need it to, to write off all those big car phone bills. Carson, hey, it's Amanda. I'm going to be about a half an hour late. Is there a nine? Anyone, are you a ten? Yeah. Do you want me to grab you a ten? Yeah, okay. okay. Thanks. Does that size good? Do they make that at half size or not? Do you want to try nine and a half? Can I? Yeah. I'm sorry. That's a nine and a half. That's a ten. This one feels like I have more room? I don't want people to think I have small feet. <clears throat> I'm really in between. It's making me crazy. Well, I'm feeling my toes like this. Where in the other one, I'm, I've got a lot of space for my toes. A day in the life. Does it get better than this? Let's go. Look at all these hats, my God. I like this one. Which one do you guys at home like best? The red or the white? I guess that's really all I needed to see. Okay. I mean... No tanks or anything? You don't need any running gear? Let's see your tanks. All right. This is what I like, the blue, the gray, and the white. This one? This sort of guy, so that I can be seen on the side of the road and not hit. This is our beautiful studio lot. It's glamorous, isn't it? This has got to be one of the ugliest lots. But it, I guess it's fitting for our show in Bundy Land. All right, that's it. Bring me up. Thank God I have a job because this is a, it's a tough 
tough bite. Now we're going to run over to Rodeo and Wilshire real quick. The Stream Street organization, super fast. I have to talk with the president, and then we're off to Valsport. Ah, this is the booth, all nice and clean. But by the end of the day, it will look quite different. Where are we? Uh, 12A? You guys uh, know Ed. Is yeah. there a script yeah. with the, all the changes in it? There. No, Rather we'll put you together pages. one. We'll put you together. Okay. Hey. How you doing? Good director. I uh, hope we see you back here again another time, and I just wanted to let you know. Uh, I know you're feeling bad, and I'm sorry, but we were happy to have you here uh, for the time that we did this week, okay? And we hope to see you again, and good luck. Okay, bye. All right. That is the worst thing to have to do to an actor. The worst thing to have to do to an actor. Because there's no way to not feel bad about it. But we were three minutes long in the script and we had to cut out a, a little bit and we lost one of our our guest stars. One of our day players or what do you call it? Guest stars. Anyway. Geraldo Rivera. This is the camp uh, that I work for. It's called Dream Street. And it's a camp for kids with cancer. I've done it for the last ten years. Hello there. Wow, this is a real office. Is Patty in? No, she's not. Oh, you're kidding me. We came in to talk to Patty, but she's, uh... She's out for the day. Yeah. <laughs> all right, so... Uh, all right. Uh, I'll, I'll call her then. So that was a major failure. But this is what my life is like. One failure after the other. Yesterday, but I have a... I got a, an 11, and I wear a 10 or 9 and a half. What do you guys think of this? Pretty weird. Gotta check it out. I don't shop. I'm not a shopper. This just happens to be a way for me to waste your time today. Okay. What do I owe you? I want to show off my new hat to the guys. If he went to the Nike store, he'd better bring me something. All right, Ted McGinley's here all, all as well. He was there an hour? What did you bring me from the Nike store? Is this for me? I can't work today. I have horrible diarrhea. Now listen. No. Ew! What a <laughs> icky thing to say. Listen, what did you bring me? Because if you didn't bring me anything, you're not getting any close-ups. <laughs> Nino's dressing room right here. Obviously, he's had. This is probably left over from some girl last night. I want to show you how hard Ed O'Neill works. Right now, he's in. Uh, he's in a meditational state, preparing for his day of work. Genius needs its rest. I'm the only one out of all these people that has his name on the on the dressing room door. That's because all the other ones were stolen because somebody cared. <laughs> Mine. Script now to direct. I don't care about like guest cast or how many sets we have. I just look for the theme of the show so I can figure out what my show bribe is going to be. These are show bribes. You have to understand them. Since this is your first show with us, Brooke, and uh, that if uh, you screw up, I take them back. Okay? okay? All right. The theme of the show is um, is Al gets broken into and he stops the burglar with his bare hand. And uh, this was working in the show, but um, not, anymore. not anymore. Got cut. Laden the show bribe. Here we go. Here, Bob, technical director. Here he comes, man. Pit pit. Okay. Okay. There you are, young man. man. Does this mean we have to do a good job? That's right, or I take yeah. it back. Hey, babe, show bribe. Oh, Hi, Dart. This is Christina's song. D'Artagnan, he'd get eaten at my house, wouldn't he? Seems to me somebody's been sneaking in here. I don't think there were this few. I swear to God, I'm missing shirts. There's something fishy going on, I swear. I can't believe I'm only down to three T-shirts. <gasps> now, wait, were there only two? Three. Didn't I have three and I put it down? Three. Something. See, it is not. As if I don't have enough to think about. Color my every Thursday, Monday, Thursday, Friday, I like to have a donut. I like to go for the crumb. Mmm. That's good. And then, what's really good is to put a little cucumber on your donut. Like this. That's what I like. That's good too. Then what I like to do, you take a little cucumber, put that on your donut. 
come over here. Where'd it go? Take a banana. There are starving people in China, and I'm throwing bananas at And this is no joke. I mean, this is sort of a routine. Take a little banana. And you just eat your banana, your cucumber, and your banana. Donut. It looks gross, but it's really a good combination. Look, see, he's trying. <laughs> mm. Mm. Hi, Mom. I bet you're proud now. Ew, gross. See, I won't eat that, so I put it back. Where am I? You don't owe me anything. Okay, we're out. I'm coming out with notes. Mondo notes. Mondo notes. Some for me, some for them. Yeah, let me go through my script. Some people have, you know, several pages in their script. Let's see here. Mm-hmm. How can I put this delicately? I've been working on that all night. Uh, which I'm sure will come through today. I guess I'll go while Amanda's directing. I Oh, I had her coming sooner, didn't I? I'm sorry, I lied, Chrissy. Can you come in? Come in, turn the lights on. Oh, hi, Daddy. Da -da 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 warm milk brings you there. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's it. And then you're right here for the other one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Sammy. Pictures except for you, and I thought I hoping that maybe you could show me something. How would you actually beat somebody up if you got in a fight situation? Uh, I would probably go like that, and then I go like that, and maybe just one. Yeah. Okay, let's go. Yeah, that's a good one, Ted. Where's he falling? Oi, Vejmir! And all this stuff has to happen quick. This has to happen. You know, pick it up, throw it in. Pick it up, throw it in. Come over here, cheat this for me, yeah. and just go, huh, huh, huh. Okay. Just boom, boom, boom. And then the watch. This is Christina Applegate. Hi. She's nothing like her character. No. She's way dumber. Thank you. Oi, Vejmer. Where's Gita? Andy is from Mexico City, mm -hmm. and he's giving me uh, Spanish lessons. So, excuse me, Mr. McGinley, would you leave the set, please? I might. <laughs> I told you she was. A... What do you say? What do you say? What do you say, Sal? Sal, you'll tell me what do you say. All right, where's Sam? Cut that close up on that. As if I had one to begin with. <laughs> When he wakes up in the morning, I'll... You know, I can... Max? Oh. <laughs> so, <laughs> never mind. Uh, Dan, I'm a professional trainer. He's just playing with Tony. Nobody. <laughs> She's a very angry assistant director. But... Oh, I hate these things. We're getting ready to roll. See, I told you she's always angry. Voice over. He plays Buck's voice. He is a dog, if you will. If I don't feel it, I'm not going to say it. I got to feel it. Or I just I can't do it. It won't leave you alone. It can't be artificial. He's very method. He lifts his leg when he uses the restroom. Rub by Tushy, and we'll talk. He's brilliant. I'll be preparing to go in now. You'll notice my preparation be very deep. Brave Chris found one brave shoe salesman who, for all of us, finally said no more. And that now is Al, the defender, Bundy. Try to keep your laughter down when I go, because it's really funny. Al, <laughs> I saw you on television. And, uh, how can I put this delicately? You were about as dull as women's golf. So, let, let me give you a little tip. Now, I know that you're looking for endorsements, but, let's face it, you're limited by your course and common look. So, we tell the advertisers that I'm Al Bundy. All right, I'm gonna go shower. Shave. Next you see me. On my way up, I'll work on my script. Al, I saw you on television. Al, I saw you on television. Hey, Al, 
I saw you on television. Hello, oh, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Ken McGinley. Oh. And the guy that plays Al Bundy, Mr. Ed O'Neill. Have a good one. See you later. Have a good one. Okay. It was great. We're going to take it from your entrance again because we lost the light, right? It's outside the door as you came in. Oh, was that it? Ah, it's going pretty well. It's going so great. That was so beautiful. That whole thing went so well. <laughs> She's got to get to the booth. She's the director. <laughs> Dad. He's making fun of me, isn't he? Uh, what am I going to do with it right before I go on the show? Well, you right. Okay, Andy gives me common Spanish phrases. ¿Qué es esto? What is this? ¿De quién es esto? Whose is this? Roll over. Roll over. Roll over. Gotta try that. This is great. If you ever want to get somebody back, you can get a little spit wad, put it down on them, they'll never know what happened. The other good thing is you can see down into the dressing rooms, ladies' dressing rooms. I won't go in that section. I, I'm forbidden. Not that I wouldn't like to show you. <laughs> Say it in Spanish, and then I'll interpret. Okay. Todos debemos ver matter with children. If you're out there and you're listening to this, go on. No, I didn't say Go that. ahead, go ahead. No. We'll finish, I'll interpret it. Okay. Todos debemos ver matter with children para aprender algo más de la manera en que se vive aquí en Estados Unidos. I'm sure that you agree, like I do, that Jefferson is the best character on the show. Oh, yeah. Jefferson. Oh, look, here comes Commander. There's the director. There's the director. Maybe up a lot sooner. Okay. Uh, director's up. <laughs> Direct, go ahead. Uh, Just know you better be behind that door a little sooner, young man. All right. Okay. See, that's why she's a good director. It is lonely not having you to come in with, but it's really lonely. Hey, what I like to do is come back here, check the hair, very cool. Make sure all the other actors are prepared to work with me. Yeah, they're all prepared. And then I, uh, then I come here and retreat and I do a little zen moment. Amanda's really not that good a director, but... Uh, oh, jeez, there she is. Are they back here right before you go on? Yes. They're back here with you right before you walk in yes. the door? It takes great discipline really on my is part. It's great for your concentration there, Jeff. Well, you know I don't have any anyway, so it doesn't matter. Then I'll answer for this. Doorbell? Might you see somebody left for charity? Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, Al! I saw you on television. <laughs> well, how can I put this delicately? You are as dull as women's golf. Yeah! <laughs> Great job. Great job. Okay, let's find out. Good night. Good night. Thanks. Thanks, everybody. Good night. Thank you. Thank you, honey. Da 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 da. The day is over. Yeah, that's it. That's a cut. A full day's work. Are you as tired as I am? Are you as tired of me as 
I may be of you. <laughs> yeah. All right, this is for real. Now, now we're out of here. Bye bye. Night. Adios. Good show, man. Thanks, and night. Oh, boy, am I tired. Whew. That director is just, she works you and works you and work you. You never get a chance to rest and relax. Can't wait for the other director to get back. What did I do with my keys? Here they are. Tough day, huh? I went shopping, I went shopping, I came here, I ate, I did a paragraph worth of work. I took a shower, I shaved, I had women touch my hair. Uh, uh. Are you going to play taps now? You want me to roll down my window? Yeah, just one more thing. McGinley.